Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever it is in your neck of the woods. This is Queen with Hood Vice 101 and my sis, Latricia Monique. How y'all doing today? All right, um, with first things first, we got the Archbishop Don Magiguan coming to celebrate his birthday with us here in Sacramento. It is on Wednesday, December 9th. That is Wednesday in what? Four days. Four days. Four, four days, y'all. Get your tickets. Definitely come out, support the event. It's going to be at Last Unlimited Downtown, 1207 Front Street. It is the, uh, we got the two all-stars going to be in the house entertaining us. We got Rico the Great, we got Andre Bailey hosting. We got Rico the Great, Regina Givens, Mario Hodge, and Insane Wayne giving you a comedy show before we start partying. So definitely come out and support us with that. And again, uh, all the information inboxes if you want your tickets early because uh, we weren't expecting this big of a turnout, but it's the tickets are going fast, so it definitely will be a sold out show. Get your tickets early. I'm talking um, about the special if they buy more than one. Oh, and if you buy more than one, we have a discount for you. So definitely holler at us for uh, the discounted rate. So uh, with that being said, we'll get into our first question, which was posted by L.A. Rhonda. She said, don't stop eating her pussy, not even when she's coming. You a motherfucking lie. <laughs> if I'm coming and them legs clamp up telling you to stop, I'm going to need your mouth to stop yeah. moving and all that. Because you will yeah. throw my motherfucking nut all the way off. All that keep going, no. <laughs> you done fucked off my orgasm then. So that's goddamn. I'm not with it. Yeah. I'm sorry. Bitch might get up and run. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, no, for real, real. Like, and no, not really. Stop. My am gonna be mad because I'm real aggressive. Gonna be real motherfucking mad at you and fix talk shit. Don't do that. Don't keep eating when I say uh stop, stop. When I say stop, bitch, know what she want, what she don't want. Growing over here. Anyway, next question was posted by my sis, Latricia Monique. Bitch, she gonna post this shit. I already know him. What's the question? Have you ever during sex worded unexpectedly all over the place? I already wrote my answer there. Like I said, I've only squirted four times in life. Three being with toys, one being with him. <laughs> and that's like <laughs> the well, only motherfucker for me to ever squirt on a dick. That's the only dick I ever squirted on. Well, yeah, I have definitely <laughs> squirted multiple, multiple. I can't count how many motherfucker times I done squirted because I done told y'all I had that mm -hmm. nigga that could push that, that button. Push the button. That yeah, button. we remember about that. That, but, but then I also have a position that can make me squirt repeated, mm -hmm. which is me on my side. So, again, yeah, that's happened multiple times. Okay. Wonderful. I remember, oh, you do you remember the first time you squirted? What, what was your reaction? I was like, what the fuck? What the fuck is that? I thought I pissed everywhere, but that shit was blah, 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 flying everywhere. And I was like, what the fuck? Scared the shit out of me. Hella embarrassing. Like, it just happened. I didn't feel it. Nothing. It just, blah, blah, blah. all I heard was. Okay, and every like, oh my god, what the what fuck, the fuck is that? And it's funny because the first time I actually squirted with a person, it mm -hmm. was someone that was well endowed. Sex generally wasn't all that, but this particular time it was. And when I got wet, what I thought was orgasm, I squirted. Mm -hmm. And both of us, he thought, and I thought that we peed on him. But I was like, I really didn't pee. I right, I know I do that. Pee, right, but I didn't know what it was at the time. Mm -hmm. First time I squirted with myself, an uh, orgasm. Mm -hmm. Bitch, it was this week called oh, yeah, Skywalker. Anybody got Skywalker? Let us know. Bitch, that shit made me so much fucking horny. Y'all squirted at it's bitch. Yeah, she told me about that. I've been looking for it. Skywalker is the name. Oh, my God. We awesome. looking for it. Yes. If you know where it's at, please, I'll add a bitch. Pay him. But, if yes. you find it, get please that shit. Get yeah. that shit. Get that shit. Girl, uh... Which uh reminds me, we are going to really uh, do a hood vice go find account for several reasons. One, our atmosphere, our taping, we need better quality. We need a little bit better stuff going on. Plus, we have these events coming up that we need uh, initial assistance with and so on and so forth. And we just want to make sure that hood vice has something going on. Real and y'all don't know, we got a lot coming up in 2016. A lot. A lot. Oh, my God. It's going to be amazing or as my yeah. baby says awesome awesome mm -hmm. okay um queen of fur posted ladies does being circumcised matter hell yeah it matter nobody want no elephant dick <laughs> my answer this go ahead is, sis. okay well here's the thing 
it's just like with anything. If a man is not circumcised, it's kind of hard to, to keep it clean. Well, not just uh. keep it. No, it's not hard to motherfucking keep it clean. You better know how. You to better keep know how to pull that skin clean. back. And That's clean. what he need the to know fuck? how to do. But no, but what I was gonna say it's hard to request that he get circumcised after being an adult. It's so true, with that, that being said. I've seen it. Keep your motherfucking shit clean and Chris clean to where a bitch really don't know. But them niggas that don't have good hygiene and you running around here smelling like a funky ass bitch. Like my That's auntie horrible. said, duck butter all in the your fuck. shit. Anyways, yeah. for you shit, ladies like. who have these boys and don't circumcise that shit, you ain't doing nothing but fucking them up when they get older. Because for trust real. me, they be wanting to that circumcise dick. Right. I've seen somebody who has, who wasn't circumcised shit was hella little. That nigga got that shit circumcised. That shit bigger than a motherfucker. Mm. I mean, come on, y'all. So for all y'all men out there who ain't circumcised, imagine if you would. My, I actually have a friend that got his um, thing circumcised as an adult, and mm-hmm. yes, it's, it's it got bigger, didn't it? Yeah, yeah, I, I, yeah I don't. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. great. That's all. Yeah, that's it got bigger. That, he in the top five. Yeah, he got he in my top five. So yeah, mm-hmm. and he got his after adult circumcised. So he my top five. Mm-hmm. Anyway, um, next question. Daniel McKinney posted. Toys, yes or no? Hell yeah, like Hell I said, yeah. I squirted three what times with a toy. I mean, I mean, it just happened like that. And you know? toys, definitely, if my mate knows how to use them. Yeah, of course. If you could, if you could work my toys magic for me, you a motherfucking keeper. Yes, boy, you a keeper. Hmm. All right, what's your biggest turn off? My biggest turn off? Mm-hmm. Stinkiness. Oh, Man, that is a big hygiene. Hygiene. You hygiene. Know. Your shit gotta know nothing. Mm. You you gotta smell like you just got out the shower and all oh, that. Damn. You want me to you want me to suck your dick? That <laughs> deal the fuck it better be clean because I'm doing a smell <laughs> test first. That's that a smell right. Smell test. But my fuck? biggest turn off, <laughs> as you probably know, being broke is my biggest turn off. Don't I can't. That's a yeah, mm-hmm. I can't. I can't. No, you can't have no little weenie. I ain't putting nothing little on my man. Uh, no, just saying. don't be broke, motherfucker. I work with a little weenie. Bitch, you, you ain't gonna work with money. nothing stanky. No, and nothing stanky. And nothing stanky. So just don't just, be broke. Just, 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 broke is a real one. Ha! <laughs> anyway, again, we got uh the bishop coming this Wednesday. So get your tickets. They're going fast. We got a few VIP uh left. A very few. Mm-hmm. Ah. I see both of them. Ah, we got a few VIP left, so definitely get at us. And again, once again, that's advice one on one for the day. Peace.